Hey everybody, Ken Surfs here. We're in the shaved in for a moment and uh, we're gonna be doing a shave later. But before that, I wanted to go down to, uh, I found out as I mentioned in a couple of videos ago, we have a local uh, store that sells wet shaving products and it's called Absolutely Fabulous. It's in Huntington Beach. It's literally a mile or so from my house. So uh, I'm gonna be going there, picking up a shave uh, soap coming back and doing a shave with a brand new razor that just came out from Blackland Razors and it's called the Evo and E-V-O. And I'm gonna show you that uh, as soon as I get back. So I'm gonna take you on a little field trip. Hopefully you don't mind that. And we'll go take a look at the store. I'm gonna buy some soap and we'll come back and use it. So, hey, let's get in the Challenger. All right, so we're gonna head over to the brick and mortar store. Absolutely fabulous. I'm gonna see about uh, picking up a new, maybe uh, some shave soap and we will do a shave with that soap today. So I'm gonna head over there right now and uh, hopefully they let me do a few shots within the, uh, within the building so I can show you what it's like in there. <laughs> Here's some of the shaving stuff. You know, I, I am a hoarder because almost all of these razors, I have one hanging in my uh, in my shave den. <laughs> You know, though, sometimes you feel like something different, right? That, that is true. That's why I'm... In the moods. Yeah, and, and these companies are coming Picture. out with, with new ones all the time. Just picked up that one. All right, what a great, great bunch of people. Uh, there's a lot of selection in there, and they said their selection's only gonna get bigger. I've picked me up some uh, Executive Man to try it again. I've tried it in the past. This is the new batch, allegedly, and uh, I liked it. And uh, the lady in the store says, this is her favorite, reminds her of England. So I'm gonna be uh, using this today. So let's head back to the shave den. You know, there's something about being able to walk into a store and see a variety of different shaving products and be able to open them up, smell them, and uh, take them home and use them. I paid $11 for this. There was uh, no shipping charges and I got it instantly. It's really nice uh, going into a store and being able to do that. And uh, the store is expanding. They're gonna be getting a lot more products and it's gonna be the site of the uh, meetup next weekend, the, uh, the the West Coast meetup. And uh, here is that flyer. Hey, I must be somebody. I made it onto that flyer. Ch check it out.
Well, I had a lot of fun talking with the owners. I, uh, I can't wait to see them again. I understand uh, there's a lot of people coming out from all over the place for that meetup next week. So it should be a blast. I'm looking forward to it. And I'm looking forward to a shave. And remember, it's Movember, everybody. Uh, I'm growing out the goatee for Movember to encourage men to and women to go and get a, a pre-screened for cancer. You know, get your prostate exam, get your uh, colonoscopy, get, you know, check for uh, skin problems. Stay proactive. It's Movember and, uh, you know, we all want to live as long as we can. It's better to catch stuff early. That, that, that's all I have to say. All right. So I'm going to be using Executive Man today. I'm going to be using a Captain's Choice brush. I haven't used this in about three months. It's a synthetic. I'm going to be using this today. And I just got an advanced razor. I, I don't know if it's on their site yet for sale, but uh, it's coming if it's not. It's uh, from Blackland. Whoops. From Blackland. And here it is here. 100% stainless steel. The head is 17.4 stainless and the handle is 303. Ah, uh, there's that little, uh, that little washer. And I know uh, I use it. They say you don't have to, but uh, I use that little washer. It's a uh, 3D printed and machined head. And let's see, I've got my stuff, my notes here. CNC machined handle and stand. It's all made in the USA, and there's 10 basic plate options. Five different uh, levels of uh, either open comb or safety bar. So you have your choices here. And the razor itself is 75 bucks with one head, and you can buy all the accessories later. That's what she looks like. She's a nice, weighty, heavy razor. And you can get the stand, the optional stand here. Here's the stand, it goes just like that. Let me set the razor down. You have, uh, I have a lot of choices of different heads here. Let's see, yeah, look, man, open combs. I've got a lot of choices and I'm gonna be having fun trying out all these different choices in the near future. So I have a few accessories that are with this. I will definitely be using them in the future. Now, they did come with some blades, but you know, I'm trying this razor for the first time for you. I haven't tried it yet. And uh, when I do that with razors, I, I like to use a blade I'm comfortable with. And this is the Wilkinson Sword Gillette from India. I'm very comfortable with that blade. I use it so often. So let's uh, line this up. I read that there's no overhang. We'll find out. I know a lot of you either like or hate overhang on the uh, razor head. I like it. Oh, and the blade base plate I'm using is level one. See that? So there's the blade. In we go. Yeah, no overhang. And there is the lineup. Very good. Looks very good. Got a little bit of knurling on the handle. That's good because if your fingers get slippery, it's nice to have something to grip. So we're going to use that today. Into the crystal skull, I'm going to put the uh, Captain's Choice brush. We'll have that soak there. Let me uh, move some stuff. This might be a little longer episode than usual. <laughs> I got to take you on a road trip, a very short road trip, but uh, you know, a road trip nonetheless. All right, uh, I need to clean up. So let's get this show on the road. Oh, and uh, here's what it uh, looks like in the sink. Almost forgot, last but not least, I'm gonna be using some classic barbershop scent, uh, classic from Barbus. Uh, I like this, I, I, I keep it around. It's, it's got a nice small container. I can take that on trips, et cetera, et cetera. All right. 
oh, the, the lady in the store is so nice. Uh, she goes, this reminds me of England. And uh, hey, how can I say no to that? I came here when I was eight, but uh, she still has her accent. And I believe Ian, the store's owner of Absolutely Fabulous, he uh, is came out here uh, when he was quite young too. I've only FaceTimed him. I haven't met him in person yet. All right. But I will before next week, I'm sure. It's nice that it's Friday. You can't go wrong with Sterling. So many good choices. Yeah, it's got the really nice classic scent. Got to meet a couple of uh, people who work at that absolutely fabulous store, and they've just they're just tumbling down the rabbit hole now. I was looking at one gent's shave uh, collection. He had a dozen soaps, some razors, and it was super cool in that store. I got to see the 34G, my favorite Mercure razor. Uh, they have that available for sale in that store. It's nice to see it hanging on a shelf. Already uh, <laughs> got some shave soap on my shoulder. All right. You know, it's funny. It's a smooth razor, but I can still grip it pretty good. So I do like that. Okay, let's see how we go with blade setting one. Nice. That's a mild setting. All right. And they said it's virtually clog free and I can see there's a big gap there. So uh, they're, they're claiming it's virtually clog free. Hear the feedback? Let's see if I cut my usual face right here. I always, <laughs> I always cut myself there. It seems like it's, this is well balanced, guys. I'm telling you, this razor is well balanced. There's a lot of these razors that you know are. $75 and above that are really heirloom quality, meaning that you can use in your lifetime and you can give it down to your kids or your grandkids. These seem to last, you know, the, the more of the quality, you know, the longer you're going to, the longer use you're going to get out of it. This head is, it seems extremely thin too. Yeah, it's extremely thin. Oh, got a little uh, tarnish and rust starting on that. Got to clean that. 34G. Very nice. Now, it left a little bit of stubble. It's not BBS because I've used the mildest head and a mild blade. So I will do one more pass. Sometimes you can get away with one pass with the more aggressive heads. But I'm not trying to get done with a shave quick. It's nice to enjoy it every once in a while, right? We work our asses off. You put up with the wife and kids and the bosses. You get into your shaved in. You have a nice shave. You try out all your new products. <laughs> yeah, executive man. All right. All right. Very 
very mild. Ooh, almost don't ever do that. Much better. You know, a lot of people are switching to uh, DE razors for nostalgia, but uh, when you think about it, I was talking to the store's owner and there's a uh, uh, absolutely fabulous as owner and there's a lot of waste uh, from the cartridge razors and we all know that's going to the landfill and uh, just the idea of something that costs a company five cents to make and they charge you know you get four blades at Costco for 20 bucks it's uh, the profit is huge but I was mentioning that it is nice to see some companies like Gillette coming out with a DE razor again. And uh, Wilkinson Sword came out with a DE razor. And there's a lot of these companies that are, have DE razors out there. So they are becoming available. They're expanding slowly. So it's nice to see. It really is. All right. shave towel here. I have to use a big towel. You know, my wife told me, you know, we have to go to Hemet tomorrow. And she goes, oh, uh, tomorrow's that shave meetup. And I have been on vacation mode, so I thought it was tomorrow too. No, it's next weekend. <laughs> so I went in there, uh, you know, introducing myself and uh, talking to the owners, saying it's going to be busy tomorrow, and they're looking at me like, you know. I came back, told my wife, I go, good news, I get to go to Hemet tomorrow, and, uh, you know, drive 90 minutes out, but actually, I, I like going out there, I like hanging out with the in-laws, and uh, the shave meetup is next week, Veterans Day weekend, so that's good, I think I'm off on Monday, so that that's, that's a good deal, all right, no nicks, come on, if, uh, if you get a good shave, close shave, and you have no nicks, you know. Aside from adding a winning lotto ticket to it, it's a it's a it's a great deal you just had. All right, Barbus from New Jersey. That's where uh, mine comes from. All right. Oh, nice burn. Let me see. Not now. I just updated the iPhone 10 to operating system 15, and it's given me like. All these messages every time I do something. Classic barbershop scent. Ready to rock. All right. Uh, oh, but I do have the iPhone 13 Pro Max coming. So I should be able to get a lot better quality pictures. And I did do a sample, uh, a sample video. I tried my father's 13 Pro Max iPhone in here just to see what it would look like. And you, it you get much wider pan of view here. So you'll see much more on this side of the shave dam and, and more on this side of the shave dam. So it, it, it's a little bit different. So I'm looking forward to trying that. It's going to be here in a couple of weeks. I've got the, uh, the blue version. So it looks pretty cool. All right, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, for those of you who are in the Southern California area or who are going to be in the Southern California area next week, I look forward to seeing you. Uh, it'll be nice meeting up with you. And it's nice to go into a store again and be around people again. I got my third, my booster, uh, Moderna booster, three days ago. Thank goodness, uh, no side effects. Arm hurt for one day, it doesn't hurt now, I wouldn't be doing that. So uh, it, it's, it's for me, because I have health issues, uh, it, it's nice to feel protected. You guys do whatever you wanna do, you know. All right, but uh, I do have that. Uh, so it's been one of those weeks. All right, everybody, thank you very much. You stay safe and we'll uh, look forward to seeing you all again very, very soon.